Now in this case, we're doing the same thing. This is still a homogeneous equilibrium. All of the states of our reactants and products is identical, except here, instead of aqueous um, uh, state of matter, we've got gaseous state of matter. So these are gases. So it's more probable that we will be writing an equilibrium constant expression for Kp instead of Kc, because our equipment will, as we monitor the changes in the amounts of these gases, will allow us to take measurements as, as pressures, partial pressures. So it makes sense to report it as Kp. So Kp would be equal to the partial pressure of our products. So our product, our first product is bromine gas, Br2, raised to the second power, times the partial pressure of water, vapor, so it's water vapor is a gas, raised to the second power because the stoichiometry is two there, divided by partial pressure of our first reactant, hydrogen bromide, raised to the fourth power, times the partial pressure of molecular oxygen, raised to the first power. So this will be the pressure equilibrium constant uh, expression using Kp here uh, to represent the equilibrium constant.